gentlemen and ladies. Ladies and gents, got to turn that voice recognition off or it'll just cause all kind of havoc right now. As a matter of fact, I'm finished for the night with the voice recognition. Uh, wasn't working on a site, but we're working on other things. Ladies and gentlemen, the AMCF, Real Estate Private Foundational Trust Organization, Artful, is officially up as of today. What we need to let you know is, as we stated, you can travel over here to the service offer. Oh, sorry. This is the actual program that puts the site up, so I have to get to the service offer page this way. You can travel to the service offer page and you can see what is being offered. Uh, there is an additional information here. We talk about the 50% recovery fee. If there are any monies recovered, then we take 50% for the previous five years. And that's because of the amount of work being done. Ladies and gentlemen, there are going to be at least 15 different documents sent to the different servicers and so forth. And we're going to be helping you guys with certain filings. So with this for this being the case, the amount of work that's being done, charging $580 is unreasonable. But we do that because we've discounted it. Why did we discount it? Because many of you guys, remember we told you it was going to be $1,500. Many of you guys cannot afford it. Sorry, it's just the way it is. Look, COVID has been going on for a couple of years, and many of you are just now trying to get back up on your feet. Now, on November 1st, which is only a couple of days from now, we will be doing car loans, helping individuals with car loans. Go over the website, take a look at the legal section to see the laws that, sorry, I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting. Anyway, go over to the legal section and take a look at the laws that are here. Take a look at the scenario that is brought forth. It lets you know that this is one of the provisions of the Congressional Act. Such notes, this includes promissory notes, shall be obligations of the Federal Reserve Bank procuring the same, and shall be in the form prescribed by the Secretary of Treasury, and shall be receivable at par in all parts of the United States for the same purposes as our national bank notes, and shall be redeemable in lawful money. So why aren't they receiving your notes? Well, we know that a promissory note is a promissory note. And it is one of those notes, according to the statute, that they are supposed to be receiving. I promise you, you'll find this information to be eye-opening about the fraud that's taken place about the 2008 meltdown. Take a look at it, and I guarantee you, you will find information that you did not know before about what took place in that and how the government is perpetuating the fraud. Yes, you heard me say it here. The government is perpetuating the fraud. Why? Why would the government do that? Well, also take a look at what Bill Clinton announced to boost home ownership. A uh, home ownership of families. Take a look at what he said. Take a look at what George Bush said. said. But remember, zero down payment incentive. All of that, you believe the banks had did something wrong. No, the government promoted that stuff. Honestly. So, take a look at what happens. And if all of these banks pled guilty to fraud, how come only one person went to jail? Wait, 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 wait. How come they're doing the same thing all over again? These are the very same points that I was bringing up initially when I was getting ready to fall, file the Quitam lawsuit, QTAM, Quitam. I was getting ready to file a Quitam lawsuit on behalf of the defrauded homeowners of America. Ladies and gentlemen, it's not over with. Getting ready to file that lawsuit, and lo and behold, the government beat me to the punch. They sat up there and just kicked me out of the way and came and stole my thunder. We're okay with that, ladies and gentlemen. We're okay with that for now, because now we got a lot of work to do. And so this new program here that we're going to be doing this work, I need you guys to understand, this site tells you some of the things that are needing to be done. Okay? This is the FBI. This is the FBI saying how seriously they take this. Let's see if they take it so seriously. Then the law is the Constitution of the United States, in, it's supposed to be and the constitutions of the state. So let me go ahead and correct this right here, right now. So the next time I upload the site, that will be corrected. And that happens a lot when it is. And then it says, am I supposed to pay taxes on my private property? The answer is, 
It depends. And then we have this last one over here. I can't see what it says because we're too far out of the way. So let's see if it's going to give it to us. There we go. Uh-oh, got to go up to the top one. That's because I made the screen too big. Anyway, if my property is in fact already considered, why am I being asked to make monthly payments? Ladies and gentlemen, if your property was in fact already paid for, why are you being asked to make monthly payments? Well, you're being asked to make monthly payments because status with the documents entitled the deed of trust stipulates it. So the document that said deed of trust says that you have to make monthly payments until you pay off the loan. But if the note and the application shows the loan is paid off, why are you still making monthly payments? That's where we come in at. That's where we come in and we do the paperwork. We document the record the way it's supposed to be done. A lot of you are missing a whole lot of stuff. I promise you. Uh, I've, I've seen all the other organizations and what they offer and how they do things, but people, we have been finding that people are missing this over here and then they're missing this over there and they're missing this over there. Why don't we tell you all the things that people are missing? Because we put together the program. We have put together the program. We have been working on this for months since the beginning of the year. We've been preparing for that. Remember, we told you they're about to foreclose on 80 million homes. They wanted to call this the year of foreclosures, but this ain't the year of foreclosures because they're waiting until next year. See, they're going to put everybody in crisis. That's why they're talking about these oil supplies and heating oils and all of this energy things. And we're plummeting into, we were 25 degrees this morning. Yesterday, we were 21 degrees. We're not supposed to be 21 degrees in the morning in October. That's not supposed to happen until, pay attention, March and February. The lowest we're supposed to be is the high 30s. That's the lowest we're supposed to get this time of year. And I'm saying 37, 39 degrees. But 21 degrees yesterday, my dogs are outside in 21 degrees. And he's looking at me, the puppy, like, really? So that's how you're going to do me. And I, I, I don't know what to tell them other than, mm, you know. All right. Uh, well, I have to go to court. Well, in order to save your property, i got to correct this too. We've got a gap. The court may be unavoidable, excuse me, but it is nothing to be afraid of as we will assist you in the proper documents you need to file. You won't even have to say much because your documents will say everything. That's what we're doing, ladies and gentlemen. We're creating the record. Ladies and gentlemen, we're creating the record. That's what all the work has been. That's what's been stressing me out and keeping me up. And Lord have mercy, I can't tell you how stressed I am this evening. This is what we do. So we have a meeting tomorrow. We had a meeting last night. We have enough people to handle what we need to do. We're combining Amer Legion and Artful and SACCOM. All three organizations coming together to help you. Okay. Follow the instructions on the website. Ladies and gentlemen, follow the instructions on the website. So when you go here, and this will be up the offer. This will be up tonight. Uh, as a matter of fact, that's why I'm doing this video, so that I can upload this information tonight. So take a look. Right here, it tells you what's being offered. This is the Contact Us page. This will send you there, but it's telling you what's being offered. This is the only one being offered as of October 25th, today. All right, I told you guys I'll talk to you tomorrow. And this is car loan package, November 1st, and this is November 15th. This is what we're offering. Some people, I do need to say this, many of you who have ordered today, we've got your order. You will hear back from us by Friday because Friday is the official start date. Okay, today was the introductory, letting you guys come in so that we can start getting documents together and start putting your information on. We will tell you what information we need. You will receive an, an email telling you what information we need. You'll receive that by Friday. And those of you, you'll receive it within 24 to 36 hours. Everyone else from this, from Friday forward, 24 to 36 hours, you'll receive an email telling you what's needed of you. Okay? There is a contract involved. Pay attention. If you don't understand me, I need you to understand. 
I will never, ever, ever, ever have you sign a contract where you're giving up your rights. Pay attention. That's why the contract is a limited power of attorney. I will never, ever do like these corporations do people, making you give up rights, making you waive rights. You're not waiving anything. Okay? You don't even need to waive bye-bye. It don't work like that. I don't play games like that. The contract is a straightforward game. All right, tomorrow. The contract is a straightforward contract. Just that simple. I said I don't play games like that, and then I read that, and that's why I said uh, straightforward game, but it's not a game. This is not a game, people. We are trying to save your home. We're trying to save you the least amount and get back the most. If you've been in your home for 20 years and you haven't paid on your property, and I know people who haven't paid on their property in the last nine years. So we don't get 50% of nothing. Because 50% of nothing is 50% of nothing. All right, God. Sorry, I just I just texted them earlier, so they're texting me back. Okay. The fee is to help keep the cost reduced for the other clients who are in dire straits. That's why we reduced it. We couldn't, $1,500, people can't afford that. We know that. But we also have to pay the individuals for helping with getting your stuff out and because of how we have to mail everything. Our greatest cost is mail and document preparation. That's our greatest cost, people. And mail is killing us. I just, I'm, we're doing about just previously $200 a week on mail. Now we're going to be almost $1,000 a week. No joke. So we have to cover our costs. I'm, I'm sorry I have to explain this because we're not trying to get anybody for anything. We can't promise you, pay attention, we can't promise you that you will have success, but you know what we're going to promise? We're going to promise that we're going to do the best we can. We're going to promise that you will have enough of a record to go ahead and take care of any argument, any comment, any court case. Oh, by the way, this does an explanation of the fees and what's going about and all of that. So that explains that. That's the addition that's being added. What I have to do is I have to save it to my computer first. So that's what this is right here. This software literally does the website. And it comes in handy. This way we don't have to pay anybody to do our site. For well, your site looks kind of janky. Well, guess what, ladies and gentlemen? All you need is the information and access to how to take care of what you need with the information. And this is how the site will look. It automatically pulls it up on the internet so that we can see it. Just that simple. All right, so now I got to load up the site so that you guys will be able to see the current information. And that's what I'm getting ready to do now. So I got to do a refresh. So one second. And I'm only doing this so you all can see, see 703, 703, 703 p.m., so that you all can see what we're doing. And so what I have to do is, wait a minute, got to make sure I have the right one up. Hold up. Wrong one. This is the right one. So one second, y'all. Access and nope, not that one. This one. And then this one. And then this one. Why are you letting people see your whole computer? They ain't supposed to be seeing all that stuff. That stuff is not for them to see. Why you just would you be quiet and leave me alone? Oh, that's right. I can't do it this way. Apologize, I have to do it this way. The original way I had it. So give me a second, y'all. Sorry, I am tired, people. Can't you hear it in my voice? I mean, literally, this has been a very stressful day. A lot of things have gone wrong and a lot of things have gone on. Yes, go ahead and overwrite. So when you guys see the site, now I do want to uh, say one other thing because we're only doing 15 minutes. Ladies and gentlemen, those of you who have seen me put together documents, I will put those up on SACOM. I will do another video showing you those documents being put up. A, thank you all for taking the time. Have a good day.